Hi, welcome to Walker Hamster. Today I went out and got this game, Guild Wars 2. It came out, came out a little while ago. I just never got around to getting it because I kept debating on uh, whether or not I should, what I should play it on essentially because it's, it only runs on Windows and I just have this MacBook Pro with Retina. So I spent quite some time yesterday installing Windows XP on my Parallel 7 uh, virtual machine software. I haven't gotten the software, the upgrade to 8 yet. I'm first see if it runs on 7. And since the Guild Wars 2 came on two DVD ROMs, I got one of these, the USB DVD or CD reader. I, well, let's see and uh, see how this installs on it. Guild Wars 2. The USB DB drive I have, it's only a USB 2, so it'll be a bit slow. Okay, it's trying to download some stuff. All right. Man, the kilobits per second is really. Unblock. Okay, well, let's go ahead and install this. Um, just choose OK. Unblock again. So while this is installing, let me just show you the resources I've allocated to this virtual machine. Let's see, let's go configure. So for this one, I gave it uh, four gigs of RAM. The uh, minimum si system requirements I set on here was, let's see how much RAM. Hmm. It didn't really say. It's focused a lot on the operating system. This is XP or XP service by two or better for the processor core two dual. But in this case, I have an i7. The MacBook Pro with Redis came with i7. Uh, so in this case, I gave it four CPUs, and let's see. Oh, it does say two gigs of RAM, as recommended, but I'm giving it four gigs of RAM. Let's see what other options I have. Optimization, fast. I want I want the faster virtual machine. Let's see applications, full screen. And let's see what we have for hardware. Hmm. Very standard. The key part, I think, is over here in general. So the progress meter is not going up, but I do see that the DVD ROM is blinking away. I think I'll just let this run. After about three minutes, four minutes, it finally reached one percent. This is going to take quite some time. The installation has finished. It took about two and a half, almost three hours. And during that time, I already went to guildwars2.com and created my account. Now I'm just going to log in, make sure it loads. Let's see. Oh, let's play. Work, work. Okay. The game works. So, what will I do? Let's see, set my server. I'm gonna hold off on creating my character for now, since I don't know what server my friends are playing on. I um, need to get back to this. But the important thing is that I just now I know the game works. 
on this virtual machine. Uh, I'll, I'll bring when I start actually start playing this game. I'll record more of my gameplay. But as for today, I'm basically just showing that you are able to install Gear Wars 2 on a MacBook Pro with Retina that's running a Windows virtual machine. I'm using Parallels 7. I have not upgraded to 8 yet. I uh, There's a virtual box out there. I used to use it, but it was a bit slow. I'm not going to bother with it. Uh, VMware is cheaper than Parallels 7, but oh well. I, I, bought, I bought Parallels 7 at a discount anyway. So I'm going to first work with what I have here, and hopefully it will suit my needs. Well, thanks for watching Over Hamster. If you have any questions, comments, suggestions, feel free to send to me. Bye.